Hello, I am Sagar Patnekar, the founder of Abhinav Commerce Classes and I am into the field of education from the last 25 years. Many number of times I have noticed that many of us have problems with the calculations. Calculations nowadays we cannot do without calculators, especially when it comes to multiplication and division. So to overcome this problem, I have come up with some tricks of getting these calculations done in fraction of seconds with the help of Vedic Mathematics. Vedic Mathematics actually has 16 sutras, what we call as 16 formulas, which we learn step by step. But in this session, before we start with what is Vedic Mathematics and its tricks, one should understand how to develop the tables. because. 16, 17, 18 tables, even 13, 14 tables, many of us are not comfortable with that. So how to develop the tables first we learn and then we will proceed with some multiplication tricks. But remember to learn Vedic Mathematics, tables up till 9 should be perfect. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9 tables you should know. Further how to develop we will see. Now see, a small trick how to develop the tables. Step 1. Multiply the least number with half of the greater number. Say for example, for example, we have 16 into 7. What is it? 16 into 7. See what is step 1? We need to multiply the least number is 7 with half of the greater number. Which is the greater number? 16. We'll half it. So it becomes 8 into 7. 8 into 7, what we get is 56. Fine, then, then step 2, double the number obtained, double the number obtained. So what 56 we got, we are going to double this, we will double this. 56, double of it is 112, double the number obtained, we get the required answer. So 16 sevens are, is 112, that's all. This is what the trick, even if, the, if you don't remember the tables, this is how we can develop the tables. See once again what I have done. 16, 7, the greater number 16, we take it half of that, it becomes 8 into the least number 7. 56, double it, we get the answer. We'll take up one more example. Say 18 into 8, 18 into 8, 18 is the greater number, so we half it, it becomes 9 into the least number. 9 into 8, what we get is 72. This 72 will double. When you double, what we get? 72, double of that is 144. So 18 into 8 is 144. See how simple the things are. One more example. Uh, we will say it as 6 into 14. 6 is the least number, keep it as it is. 14 is the greater of that half, 7. 6 7 is 42. This 42 we are going to double. So when you double 42, what we get is 84. So 6 into 14 is 84. This is how we can develop the tables. Then, say for example, it is 12 into 8. 12 is the greater number, so 6 into 8. What we get is 48. This 48, we double. What we get is 96. So, 12 eights are is 96. So, this is how we can develop the tables. Tables with even numbers. 12, 14, 16, 18 and so on. Now, if we can observe here, Two digits table is multiplied with single digit. What happens if both are two, uh, double digit numbers? Let's see. Say for example, the number is like this, say. 14 into 18. Both are two digits number. We'll divide it. We'll have it. How H-A-L-V, how it means what? We'll divide into two equal parts. So 14, say, we divide by 2. What we get is 7. 18 divide by 2. What we get is 9. 7 into 9, 63. If it is a single digit number, single digit number like this, we double it once and we get the answer. When we have two digits number, double it, not once, twice. That is 63, we first double it. What we get is 126. This 126 also we double it. What we get is 252. So 14 into 18, when you multiply, what answer we are going to get is 252. So simple. Next, take it as 16 multiplied by 12. First, we first we'll have it. When you have the numbers, it's going to be 8 
into 6. Half of 16, half of 12. 8, 6 are 48. We double this. What you get is 96. We double it. When double 96, what you get is 192. So 16, when you multiply by 12, what answer we get is 192. Take up one more example. Say 14. We'll multiply by 16. Half of 14, 7. Half of 16 is 8. So 7 into 8, 56. We double it. 112. We double it. What we get is 224. So 14 into 16, what we get is 224. That's all. This is how we develop the tables with even numbers. I repeat. Multiply the least number with half of the greater number, then double the number obtained, we get the required number. These steps are to be applied when we have single digit number, one single digit number. If you have two single, two digits numbers, both are two digits, double it twice. We have the number, that is we make it half, we get the answer, double it, again double it, that is a required answer. The other tricks, what we should understand. Fine. So in this session, we have learned how to develop the tables. In the next session, we shall start with some multiplication tricks using Vedic Mathematics. Thank you.